Hello everyone, I am a piece of bread 154 back with another mod review. Today we're going to be reviewing the Simple Corn mod by CleverPanda714. And what the Simple Corn mod does is it adds a new plant called corn, as you might have imagined. And yeah, it's intended to be in line with the way other Minecraft crops are implemented. Um yeah and just have a vanilla feel and be pretty simple so let's get right into it okay so to get corn you have to craft it oh Jesus to get corn you have to find the seeds like every other plant in Minecraft and you do that by just breaking wheat or breaking glass breaking grass blocks and occasionally you will find uh, corn kernels oh occasionally you will find corn kernels which are corn seeds of course um, and you use those to plant corn and the corn plant itself has a really nice texture and model I mean look at that it's t about two and a half blocks tall uh, and if you go through it you move through it slower than you do on uh, normal terrain can't it's kind of hard to tell but it's more it's more obvious in survival mode but I don't want to go in survival mode because there's a creeper right there but yeah this is really nice because a lot of other mods that add corn like I don't know, I think it's called Simple Foods or something. They'll have corn be just one block tall like that. And if you've ever seen corn, uh, and let me tell you, I see a lot of corn. It's not like that at all. It's huge and it's itchy. And yeah, and the corn just looks fantastic when it's put in big... Um, fields like this uh, and you can get lost like super easily because it's so dense um, just like in real cornfields if you ever get lost in a cornfield um, uh, you'll die and there's no other alternative so the corn takes a bit of a while to grow and bone meal doesn't seem to work properly on it uh, let, let me show you let me show you what I mean so there we go you got your corn and then bone meal once, bone meal twice, bone meal three times, bone meal four times. And then it pops and it just gives you the kernels. So you can't actually use bone meal to grow corn. Uh, you can use it to get more corn kernels, but not to get the ear of corns. And uh, as you might imagine, the ear of corn comes from the fully grown corn plants. So you can just right click on the top to harvest, I think. Or you can punch it. Ooh. I, okay, I guess not. Maybe I should go into survival, actually. Yeah, let, let me do that. So, yeah. You can punch it, and you'll get the nine uh, ears of corn. Or right click it. And only get three. So I think that only takes it off the top there, yeah. Uh, excuse me. Yeah, corn, it's great. Uh, each ear of corn heals, as you can see, half a chicken nugget. So it's not great. It's about the same as a raw potato. But there are several uh, new... Ooh. There are several new recipes that we will look at that can make this corn into a far more nutritious meal. So if we just head around to my uh, little farmhouse here. Mmm. I can smell the corn cooking. Uh, so if I just throw this corn in here, uh, you can, as you'll see. Any second now. <laughs> there you go. You get roasted corn, which instead of healing just... Half a chicken nugget, it heals three. 
So it's a really good um, food source. Let's see, is that better than a baked potato? So yeah, yeah, that's better than a baked potato, which makes it the best um, uh, <coughs> best uh, like plantable food source, I guess. Um, I don't know what you'd call it, farmable. Um, so yeah, if you want to remain a vegetarian in Minecraft, corn is definitely a good way to go. And whenever I play with this mod, I pretty much exclusively eat corn. Um, because, you know, corn is the uh, greatest thing that has ever evolved. Um, and yeah, it's the, literally the perfect food. But if just normal roasted corn isn't good enough for you because you're some sort of disgusting, uh, filthy food snob, there are a couple other ways you can cook corn. For example, let's take this ear of corn out here. You can craft it into corn chowder, which heals three and a half hunger bars by using a milk bucket and two corn kernels in a bowl. And, um, well, it's pretty good. I mean, that's a little bit better than mushroom stew, I believe. Yeah, that's better than mushroom stew, but it's not as easily obtainable as mushroom stew. Like, you can't get it from like a, um, a corn shroom, which they should totally have in this mod, by the way. But it's still pretty nice, and it adds a use for milk buckets, besides just exclusively being used to make cake. But yeah, um, stews are kind of useless in Minecraft. But you can also make chicken corn chowder, which heals five chicken nuggets. So that is a great uh, food source. Um, let's see, is that better than golden carrot? Uh, well... Okay, I don't actually know. But yeah, and that's just adding a cooked chicken there. That's kind of annoying because it just barely doesn't fit into your crafting window there. So you'd have to make a crafting table to make that. And it's not stackable, of course. So yeah, not a great food source. All of the stews are kind of awful in Minecraft. But they just add a nice bit of variety. And the final thing you can do is if we take some of these, you can make corn kernels into popcorn. Oh yeah. Now popcorn only heals half a chicken nugget of hunger. So it's not good, but I mean, you get a ton of it. Like, if you, sh I'll show you if you can uh, take this ear of corn, turn it into corn kernels, and then pop those, and you'll get twice as much um, hunger back as if you just ate the raw corn. Uh, although, you'd also get even more if you just cook the corn itself. But you, that's, that's not the point. Um, and, but if I lose some of my hunger here, I can show you the nice feature of... Um, come on, give me hunger. The nice feature of popcorn. Okay, I don't know why I'm not losing hunger, but popcorn, um, basically you eat it really fast. It literally takes, I think, half a second to eat one popcorn. So if you have a full stack of popcorn, you can eat it super fast and just gain a lot of, uh, a lot of chicken nuggets really quickly uh, so that is nice uh, because eating kind of takes a while and if you just need to heal a couple of hunger points really quick having popcorn in your inventory is a nice thing to have and let's see if I can apply the hunger effect to myself um, I'll, I'll cut this right here okay so now I have hunger so you should see in a second that I will start Oh no, I, d I won't because I'm in peaceful mode, right? So as you can see, in a second I will start losing hunger points. Um, and then I can show you how the popcorn is useful. So come on, let's go. Oh, and you saw earlier that you can craft cor uh, ears of corn into two corn kernels, and that's how you get uh, more kernels. 
Yeah. Wow, really? That's it? Whatever. Anyway, as you can see, you can eat popcorn extremely fast. And it makes a nice chomping effect, which you can't see because my Minecraft doesn't have sound right now for literally, I don't know, whatever reason. But, yeah. That's pretty nice. And that about does it for the simple corn mod. Uh, oh, as you can see with the corn chowder, it's basically just the mushroom stew, but yellow. And the chicken corn chowder, you can see, has little chunks of chicken in it. So yeah, that about does it for the simple corn mod, except for one feature. Um, uh, uh, <coughs> ugh. Except for one feature that exists that's not really working all that well. But I'll show it to you anyway. So if we just uh, head out past my grill there to my secret shed, you can see Firework Rocket with the popcorn effect. And unfortunately, this effect doesn't seem to be working. If I launch it off into the sky, you can see it just disappears. But what it's supposed to do is it's supposed to shoot popcorn out when the firework rocket explodes. And you craft it just like any other variation of fireworks by just throwing corn kernels in uh, with the firework star recipe. So yeah, it's a shame that doesn't work. Uh, maybe I'll throw a picture up here of what it's supposed to look like. And maybe I won't. Uh, but yeah, that about does it for the simple corn mod. And I really like this mod, actually. Uh, mainly because, you know, uh, I live in an area with a lot of corn. And so, you know, you gotta learn to appreciate corn. And also because... It just, it feels exactly like something that would be in the vanilla game. Um, and that's the intention. It feels like Mojang could legitimately add this mod in its entirety to the vanilla game, and no one would complain. Because it's just so perfect. It's a wonderful mod, very simple, I really like it. And normally I hate um, food mods, because they're literally pointless. Like, why would I want to go, why would I want to make, like, I don't know, chicken cordon bleu in the Minecraft when I could just eat a steak and restore four hunger points? Why would I go through a 15-step crafting recipe to make a pizza when there's already perfectly good food? Like, I just don't get it. There's no reason to add more food into Minecraft if people are constantly suggesting it to Mojang. Even though, again... Like, why would you use anything other than steak and possibly golden carrots and maybe chicken if you have an automatic farm going? But people love food mods for whatever reason. I guess they just like the roleplay element. But enough whining about food mods. I think this mod is different. I think it is a... just a lot more... not necessarily creative, but just a lot more fun. And I think it just adds a nice bit of variety to the Minecraft crops, especially with how tall they are. Like, I really like that. It really makes farms feel more, like, dense. And, yeah, it's definitely, out of all the food mods that exist for Minecraft, probably my favorite. So, that about does it. I have been uh, a piece of bread 154, and this has been the Simple Corn Mod by CleverPanda714. And yeah, my link will be in the description, and remember to, um, I guess like and subscribe, or don't, you know? Uh, I, I can't force you to do anything that you don't want to do. Goodbye.